A drop of kindness creates a ripple that lasts a lifetime. That one seemingly insignificant act can create a wave of good deeds that can affect thousands. In 1975, that first drop of kindness happened when the gift of life brought five-year-old Grace Aguaro from Uganda to New York for life-saving heart surgery. Rotarians, hospitals, doctors, nurses, and volunteers all banded together and gave of their time, talents, and resources to begin the gift of life. Their collective mission was simple, to save the life of a little girl. The result was the creation of a program that promotes world peace and understanding by providing life-saving open-heart surgery to children suffering from congenital heart defects, regardless of race, color, creed, gender, or national origin. One by one, the drops of kindness kept coming as a grassroots network of Rotary Clubs partner organizations and ethnic volunteers kept working tirelessly to save the lives of hundreds more children. Children who had no place else to turn. So they turned to us and we were there for them. Another drop happened in 1983 when Nancy Reagan brought two Korean children, V. Kil Woo and An Ji Suk to St. Francis Hospital in Roslyn, New York that one act of kindness rippled into thousands more children whose lives were saved by the gift of life. Our most recent drop of kindness was in October of 2008, when the Global Network of Gift of Life programs celebrated the saving of the 10,000th child. One by one, these acts of kindness are not only saving the lives of children, but also helping the community from which they came, developing goodwill and bonds of friendship and trust. And when the children are healed, they go back home, eternally grateful to those who gave them a second chance. The scar on their chest is a constant reminder of the kindness extended to them by a stranger for no other reason than their need. These children and their families demonstrate their gratitude by giving back to their country and people. They become our network of ambassadors of peace. What began as one solitary act of kindness has blossomed into a worldwide mission of saving lives and promoting peace. Outstanding people have long been involved with Gift of Life because they recognize that anyone can make a difference and it's up to each of us to try. As the late Danny Thomas said, that a child should die before its time is simply unacceptable. At Gift of Life, we're dedicated to saving the lives of children who cannot save themselves. Like Grace, there are thousands more sick and needy children who are looking for help. Without that help, their hearts will stop beating. The parents wait and pray for a miracle, a miracle that will save their child's life. There are so many children like this child who wait with patient hope that someone hears their pleas. Their frail voices have to compete with the noise of this world, but their plea, however faint, is there, and it's real. When children reach out for help, we can answer them with your help. One heart, one child at a time. It is the power of one single act of kindness, your act of kindness, that makes a difference. Won't you join us? Join the gift of life, journey of the hearts. When you cure the heart in the child, you cure the heart in all humankind. My eyes have seen 30 years 
of sunrises and sunsets. Have seen my mom, dad, and family grow older for 30 years. I have gone to school, worked, and been with my friends. Lived life for 30 years because of you. No one could ever put into words what you have given me. Thank you Rotarians for giving us the gift of life.